G'day Ice Cream Lovers, Steve Christensen's my name, the self-appointed headmaster of Scoop School down here, St. Louis, Missouri. I can't tell you how great it is to have you tune in. It's funny, you know, when people have ice cream questions and they call Scoop School, and they're actually quite surprised that I pick up the phone because why wouldn't I pick up the phone because I'm the self-appointed headmaster. And we often get people saying, I just watched all your videos. <laughs> so we do appreciate you being here. Look, reach out to us. Call us, email us, leave a message down below. We try and get back to everybody with their ice cream questions and conundrums. Uh, we've got a uh, pretty good episode this uh, week. We do want to thank our episode sponsor, which is Lloyd's of Pennsylvania. Now, Barry and Andy Jones, they do a whole lot of things there at Lloyd's. Yes, you could say they're a mixed company and they do soft serve and premium and custom mixes. Very, very good. UHT, long shelf life, 60 to 90 days. Uh, but Barry is also a food scientist, so you have any formulation questions, um, talk to Barry, talk to Andy at lloydsofpa.com, link down below. Thank you for your episode sponsorship. In fact, um, we just rebuilt the Scoop School website and all of our episode sponsors are listed there under our suppliers tab. Please support them, please go there because they are the ones that continue to allow us to provide this free content to you every single day. So, um, we do want to talk in this episode primarily about soft serve and something that's known as a rosette cap. Now, a rosette cap may look a little bit different per manufacturers. This is a Taylor soft serve rosette cap. I'm trying to get, <coughs> trying to get it to focus on that instead of me. This one here is a Stolting rosette cap. I know it wants to focus on me because I'm so good looking. And this one here is an Electrofreeze uh, rosette cap. And what you'll find is, um, what they have in common is that they each have this star logo or this star imprint in them. Now each of these rosette caps have a particular function. They actually clip underneath the extraction port or the plunger, if you will, the spigot of your soft serve machine. And what it does is allows you to use that uh, star-shaped um, star uh, look or effect to your soft serve cone. If you leave them off, so if you leave one of these off your soft serve machine, you'll actually have it come out almost like in a tube and you can use dollops, almost like what Dairy Queen does. Uh, but if you want that traditional star-shaped ribbed uh, soft serve product, you really should have uh, a rosette cap on. Now, these are generally provided by your equipment uh, manufacturer. They'll come in a spare parts kit. A couple of things that you need to be aware of is that just like any O-ring, any gasket, any valve, these do need to come off at the end of every wash cycle. So as you're uh, basically pulling down or dismantling your soft serve machine for cleaning, please make sure it's very easy to overlook some of these rosette caps, particularly the ones that are a lighter color and you may miss them. But as you're pulling the front plate off your machine, please make sure that these come off as well because you'll often get dairy product building here inside the cap where that cap uh, affixes to the bottom of your front plate uh, and you can get dairy product in there, it can go bad. So uh, number one, always make sure that you're cleaning that as you go through. Secondly, you do want to make sure, like any gasket or valve, that this actually needs to be inspected to make sure that it's not cracked or broken or brittle. Because the last thing you want is to pop a uh, rosette cap underneath or at the plunger or spigot of your soft serve machine and have pieces of plastic coming off it. You probably won't believe it if I told you, but it's 100% true. I was doing a training in a, um, uh, how am I going to put this? A big ice cream uh, business, international ice cream business. And um, while I was doing the training there, I noticed that one of the employees was actually gluing one of these together with super glue. Do not glue them together. Do not reuse them if they're broken. This is a wear part. Your equipment manufacturer will be able to provide you with a new set. They're relatively inexpensive. In fact, you may want to also ask if there are any other designs. Um, because having this in different designs may give you the opportunity to, uh, to go through and have just a little bit different looking ice cream. 
So that's a rosette cap if you ever hear the term. Um, again, if you want that nice star shaped or ribbed appearance to your soft serve, it should be on. Uh, you should take it off with every clean. You should make sure that it's not cracked, broken or brittle. And uh, look, it's just a little thing, but it can add to your customer's perception of your soft serve uh, uh, mix and your soft serve end product. Very important. Uh, so thanks for joining us. Thank you very much to Andy and Barry Jones at Lloyd's for their episode sponsorship. And if you would like an answer to a ice cream business question that's been burning inside you for years, drop us a line, steve at scoopskill.com uh, or just uh, hit the comments down below. We try and read everyone and uh, respond to them. Uh, and for all of your other ice cream needs, scoopschool.com is the place to go. Keep on scooping, folks. We'll see you in the next video.